Triple H is still going for AEW's jugular. Fightful Select is reporting that NXT is going to put on a pay-per-view the same night as ROH Final Battle. The NXT pay-per-view will be called Deadline and will air on September 10th. Now, the last time ROH and NXT had a pay-per-view on the same day, they at least staggered the times. No time has been made public yet of when NXT Deadline will air, but we'll have to wait and see. I'm just surprised Triple H is still doing this. They still lost that Tuesday night battle, even though they brought in a bunch of main roster stars. NXT only got 600,000 viewers, which is up from where it was, but AEW got 700,000 viewers, which is down from where that was. But AEW also was on the wrong night. Their viewership was going to be down anyway. What's hilarious to me is WWE keep trying to undermine AEW, but then they get mad when Tony Khan doesn't let Billy Gunn be part of the DX reunion. You're trying to destroy me, bro. Why would I let one of my stars be a part of your thing? I don't know. I feel the battle between AEW and WWE is stupid. They can be two wrestling companies. Only reason WCW and WWE went head to head is because Ted Turner created WCW to destroy WWE. And WWE never put WCW out of business. There was a merger and the executives didn't like wrestling. So they got rid of WCW for cheap. There is a market for two major wrestling companies and for everybody to make money. So they don't really need to go head to head. And now that Triple H is in charge, I watch and enjoy both of them regularly. So I don't even care about the battle between them. I want stars to jump from WWE to AEW and from AEW to WWE just so I can see some dream matches I want to see.